Most smartphones nowadays have advanced specs and displays that might go to waste if we do not run the games that have been developed to complement the brilliant software of these phones. The magnificent graphics of some of these are genuinely marvelous and would provide a lot of fun to the players. This video is brought to you by Answerly, a question platform that pays you for adding high-quality answers on different questions. The users are rewarded in Answerly tokens, which they can easily convert into dollars or any other cryptocurrency by using one of the exchanges mentioned in the description. Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be talking about the top 10 new Android games for 2022. Providing good graphics is not the end of the story. Games nowadays have original and fantastic gameplay that is sure to leave you hooked. The best part about these modern smartphones is that you do not have to choose either better graphics or better gameplay. You can have both. Here are the top 10 games that will let you have the best of both worlds. Gwent The Witcher Card Game If you're anything like us, you can't wait for Season 2 of The Witcher on December 17th. But if you're growing impatient for your Witcher fix, let this fill your time until then. Hardcore Gwent fans are no strangers to the PZ version, but now you can get your fill on to go with the mobile version. Hand-drawn art and stunning visual effects breathe a new life into every PvP duel, and there's no shortage of challenges thanks to the new arena mode that Geralt of Rivia himself would relish. You can choose from a variety of other modes too, from classic to seasonal. It's free-to-play Gwent, but a word of warning, you may see little of the light of day as you toil to build a deck you can be proud of and collect cards to gain spells and special abilities. If you're up for the challenge and you'll find Gwent the Witcher card game easy to get into, hard to master, and it makes for a satisfying morning commute or a sweet time sink whenever you have some time to spare. Simulacra 1 and 2 whether you've never played a found phone game before or a huge fan of the genre, Simulacra and its follow-up Simulacra 2 are well worth playing. The premise is simple. You find a phone belonging to a girl named Anna, and on it is a video message that appears to be a cry for help. It's up to you to piece together the pieces of the mystery and find out what happened to her. Clues come in the form of videos that unlock over time, photos, text messages, emails, and more. The phone often behaves strangely, glitching in and out and making odd noises. Did somebody say, creepy? Along the way, you'll meet Anna's friends and co-workers, swipe right or left on Spark, a dating app reminiscent of the most famous swiping app around, and watch videos filmed by live actors. It's an immersive and unique experience, but make no mistake, this is definitely a horror game, and it will leave you feeling more than a bit uneasy throughout. Grid Autosport Grid Autosport is as close as you'll get to console quality racing on Android, with around 100 circuits to blaze through and a huge selection of 100 cars too. The controls are fully customizable, so you can choose between tilt, wheel touch, or arrow touch, or use a controller if that's more of your style. There's plenty of longevity here too, with a huge range of disciplines from endurance and demolition to drift, drag, and street races. Sky Children of the Light Fans of Journey and Flower will love the latest game from the same creators, Sky, Children of the Light is every bit as beautiful as the team's other two games. It's an adventure, but with a social twist. You can play as one of the Children of Light sent to bring hope to the kingdom and return fallen stars to their constellations. The Kingdom of Sky has seven gorgeously rendered realms to explore, and you can customize your character to your liking before setting out chat and team up with other players to take on missions, save spirits, uncover treasures, and explore darker, more dangerous realms. Playing with others is a beautiful experience here, and there's no shortage of players to team up with, but with that said, solo play can quickly become boring. Dead by Daylight Mobile Halloween may be over, but the long, dark November nights are the ideal time to dive into a multiplayer horror. Team up with your friends for this 4v1 adventure where you choose to play as a survivor or a killer hunting survivors. The best bit? You can play as a killer from one of your favorite horror movies like Michael Myers, Letterface, or even the demo Gargan from Stranger Things. Or team up with your buddies as a survivor and select from a range of horror movie icons like Halloween's Laurie Strode or Stranger Things Steve. With randomly generated maps and plenty of jump scares, Dead by Daylight Mobile is free to play and offers virtually endless fun. 
before we move on to the next exciting game on the list. Like this video, smash that subscribe button and click that notification bell right now or you'll be hunted down by Michael Myers. Oxen Free Oxen Free is a supernatural 80s horror game has a cool synth-pop soundtrack and has rightfully been compared to Stranger Things. You play as Alex, who is traveling to an overnight party on a spooky island with her stepbrother Jonas and friends, when they accidentally open a ghostly rift. Alex must deal with the terrifying creatures unleashed and solve the mysteries within. Every decision you make and every conversation you have changes your relationships and the story. This is definitely a game for those who love story-driven gameplay and it's one that will stay with you long after the conclusion. Dead Trigger 2 Dead Trigger 2 is built as a non-stop FPS action zombie shooter game. Hunt down to hordes of undead in 10 regions and across 33 different battlefields and take them out with more than 70 types of weapons from rifles, shotguns and rocket launchers to machetes, chainsaws and wrenches. You could even chuck a lethal chicken at them if you like. Cutting edge graphics and grossing missions, weekly tournaments and the ability to build a personal hideout and plan your strategy ensure Dead Trigger 2's good for hours upon hours of gameplay. Into the Dead 2 Zombie Survival In this endless runner, your goal is to survive the zombie apocalypse and save your family. The sequel to the original Into the Dead game, Into the Dead 2 features 7 chapters and 60 stages with a huge arsenal of weapons from shotguns to machetes. You'll fight hordes of the undead across a wide variety of detailed locations, from abandoned farms to oil fields and military bases and encounter different types of zombies along the way, like armored zombies and runners. Best of all, you can have a canine companion on your adventures. And there are special story events like the Ghostbusters 1 or a prequel to the Night of the Living Dead. Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition is the 15th installment in the Final Fantasy series. This mobile version of the original console game divides the story into 10 chapters. You can play the first for free with subsequent chapters available for purchase. Behind the cute animation lies a stunning soundtrack and a sprawling story that tells the tale of the chosen king, savior to the star. The nations of Niflheim and Luxus have finally agreed to an armistice after years of fighting. Noctis, the crown prince of Luxus, is betrothed to Lady Lunafreya of Tenebrae, the youngest oracle in history. As a symbol of this peace, the prince sets forth for his wedding on the eve of the signing ceremony, but unbeknownst to him, many perils await him on his journey. And our top one pick, Pokemon Unite. Pokemon Unite is a 5-on-5 five -five team battle where you team up with friends and other players from around the world to see who can score the most points. Working together to beat the other team is key, and you can communicate with your team through quick chat messages, signals, and voice chat. Ensure your Pokemon are stylish and ready for battle in a variety of hallware. Then take on the other team in Unite Battles, where you can use Unite moves. All new Pokemon moves only available during these battles, as your skills improve battle and rank matches to top the leaderboard. Pokemon Unite is free to play and cross-platform, so you can play with friends on mobile or Switch. Well, there you have it, our take on the top 10 games for you to try out. What is your favorite Android game? Let us know your thoughts down in the comment section below. If you like this video, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe to this channel. To learn more about Anterly and Anterly tokens, check out the links in the description.